Welcome to the Lifetime Assembly Channel. My name is John, and today we're going to go over everything you need to know about adding a heater to your doghouse. When it comes to finding a heater, there may be several options available. You can find them on Amazon, your local hardware store, or your local farm supply store. Before purchasing your heater, make sure it will fit within the frame of the mounting bracket. The mounting bracket size is 11 inches by 12 inches. It's preferable the mounting holes on the heater line up with the pre-drilled holes on the mounting bracket. If they don't, you'll have to drill your own holes on the mounting bracket. In front of me are two heaters purchased from Amazon that will work with the pre-drilled holes on the mounting bracket. The link for these is in the description below. Most heaters don't come with the necessary hardware to attach to your mounting bracket. You can purchase the hardware at your local hardware store. For the heaters we've recommended, you'll need four number 10 screws with the appropriate washers and nuts. The screws should be no longer than one and a half inches and no shorter than one and a quarter inches. When you originally purchased the doghouse, it came with this bracket and the hardware. It's not necessary to attach the bracket if you don't plan on using a heater, but if you've already attached it, you will need to remove it to attach the new heater. If you no longer have the mounting bracket or hardware, you will need to reach out to our customer service team at the number below. The mounting bracket has a top and bottom side, so before you add your heater, make sure it's oriented correctly. The top side of the bracket has these holes closer to the edge. Place the power cord through the large opening on the mounting bracket. Line up the holes in the heater with the holes in the mounting bracket, making sure they're both oriented properly. Then insert the bolts you purchased from the hardware store into the holes and add the nut and washers on the back. Make sure you tighten this hardware completely. If you haven't already, insert the screw anchors into these recesses on the inside of the back wall. Place a mounting bracket over the screw anchors making sure the holes at the top line up. The bolts will go into the holes at the top and the screws will go into the screw anchors. Once the hardware is secure, insert the power cord into the bushing on the floor that you added during the assembly. There's a notch in the floor panel on the back so the power cord doesn't get squished. There's a channel below the heater to help with cable management. The cable on our heater was a little too thin, so we wrapped tape around where the notches are so that the cord stays in place. Before you plug in your heater, it's crucial that you review all safety and operating instructions that come with the heater to prevent serious injury or property damage. Thank you for watching this video on how to add a heater to your lifetime doghouse. If you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to our customer service team.